you know. I'm thinking it might just be possible that William Lane Craig is a complete moron. I was watching a video on uh, non-stamp collectors other channel. Non-stamp collector 2 I think it's called. And he's got uh, a quote from Len Craig in there. Um, the moral argument. The moral argument as I frame it goes like this. If God does not exist objective moral values and duties do not exist. If God doesn't exist, then there is no objective morality. And the next thing he said after that was... And by objective I mean mind independent. Which I thought was odd because I always assumed that the idea of objective morality was that God set the objectiveness of the morality by his vast mind. He knew everything, therefore by his mind he set the objective morality. And yet apparently objective morality is mind independent. Therefore objective morality has no need of a god. So according to William Lane Craig, as far as I can follow so far, he says if there is no god there is no objective morality, and by objective morality, he means, more or less, morality that can exist without God. As if you require God, then you are saying, well, the arbiter, the supreme arbiter of morality is God. That's the purpose of putting God there. Which which itself is, is kind of a, a bastard um, appeal to authority. Where you say, look, I believe that this is moral. And then you make up an authority that is imaginary, that you just invent on the spot to back up your point of view, your opinion. And that, that's a pretty base and devious thing to do. Luckily, we're not all stupid. Go shove your objective morality up your butt, William. Our churches are filled with Christians whose minds are idling in intellectual neutral. I've got to crack these nuts off now. <laughs>